This video is going to show you how to make a QR code with Bitly. The reason why I'm choosing Bitly is really two reasons. One is it's very popular. A lot of people who use Twitter use Bitly automatically. Most of you probably have a Bitly account already. Okay. Second reason is that it's free. All right. Uh, so what you do is you grab the URL for the website that you want to use in your QR code. All right. And in this case, I'm actually using this article right here, Use QR Codes to Thank Holiday Supporters by Joe, my good friend Joe. And I'm just going to copy the URL right at the top. I'm going to pop over to Bitly, right? so it's B-I-T-L-Y dot com. I'm logged in. I paste the link, okay, and automatically it gives me the short link. I copy that link. I paste it into the browser, right? And it's going to obviously redirect back to this article. All right. So how do we create a QR code? Right. The way that you do that with Bitly is you simply copy the link into your browser and then type dot QR after it. Hit enter. You're forwarded to your QR code. And you take this image. You open the image in a new tab. Okay. That way we're just getting literally just the image here. You save this as a PNG, JPEG, or GIF file, and then add it to your printed material or whatever it might be, a postcard, a poster, or an annual report. And then uh, you, you can obviously track this uh, URL as well back in your Bitly account. All right? So the only thing that's really changed is that we're just converting that link to a QR code. We're changing the format of the link in a sense. Um, but with your Bitly account, you can obviously measure how many people are scanning the QR code. That information is going to be free in your Bitly account. Okay? Talk to you soon. Bye.